Hi everyone, my name is Paula Taylor and this is Tackle the Feelings Before the Behaviour or TFBB. And today, after a lot of political unrest around our parts here in South Africa and KwaZulu-Natal at the moment, I started to think about ethics. Um, ethics in relation to politics, ethics in relation to boundaries, ethics in relation to getting to know yourself and your confidence and your self-esteem and healing shame and disgust and things like that. Um, and something that we learn about if we do sociology or even psychology and things like that, where you, you take things a little bit further looking about the human psyche and and groups of people and all of that, and, and ethics can clash. And ethics are a bit different to legal rules and, you know, all those things that the, the socialization that you have to follow and things like that. Ethics are your own limits. They like boundaries in relation to what is right or wrong in behavior, in how we put ourselves out in the world, in terms of what's acceptable and what isn't, in terms of treatment of others, treatment of ourself, that kind of thing. It's what is, what is good and bad for, for us in terms of our beliefs. Our ethics come into our beliefs as well. And it's that thing where you could go in and steal something and no one would ever know. What stops you? You know, what stops you making out with your friend's husband if he's had a bit too much to drink and hitting on you? What is your code? And I think that that is that a lot of us are like stealing and child abuse and this and that. But when we get specific in that and we put in... In, the, in, in front of a moral dilemma, you know, where, where there, it's not as cut and dry. You know, I, was, I thought about um, a situation with one of my clients who's from a different developing country, growing up um, in a bit of a gang sort of situation where the closest people, the most love he knew were for people who also hurt women or killed other people and did things and loving someone and, and really having a problem with what they they do, it, it can really mess you up in terms of who you are and what you believe in and where your limits are and your deal breakers. And I think it's worth knowing because at the end of the day, we need to be strong in what we believe in above all else. We need to we need to carry our code of ethics higher than what's acceptable in the group around us or what the law says in terms of, you know, if, if stealing so I can't steal. It needs to be greater than that. It needs to be something that, that keeps you in check. It's your conscience. And there are a lot of people who have a lot of trauma which prevents them from feeling a conscience, from feeling empathy and things like that. And I think that is what we are in this world in amongst. And if we just follow the sheep, follow the masses, just believe what people tell us at face value, and we don't look at congruency if actions line up with words and and things like that, and we and we look at what is acceptable, what is this disrespect? How do we want to live our lives? I think our ethics really need to come into play, just like our boundaries in terms of deal breakers or or things that we we hold important when valuing how close or or, or how important something or someone is in our lives. Um, just food for thought. I hope that's been provokingly helpful. Have a great day. Bye.